Hey, what's going on, you guys? Just learning to grow my own. Just out here, I figured I'd give you guys a little update. You know, I know fall's coming in, and want to show you some of the stuff I still got going on. So that hardy banana up there, and the super dwarf banana that you can see back here, produce some pups for me. So I got these guys in little buckets right now, grown. These four or five you see right there are all hardy. And then this is the super dwarf right here. And then, as you see, the grapes and everything are all done. Blue Jays robbed me from those. Um, the lemons, the lemon Myers is doing well. The miracle berry, you can see the Miwa kumquats coming in pretty well. Still got all the mints. Small little orange. And you can also see the pineapples are coming in pretty good right here you can see the watermelons i got coming in there's one there there's one there then there's one all the way in the back back there this is where i originally had the corn growing the corn stopped so i just threw a couple of seeds in there from the watermelon and i started getting the watermelons here's the super dwarf banana cavendish Here's the other one, still in containers growing, super hardy, about like seven, eight feet tall now. Right here's the avocado, Miwa kumquats, you actually see the kumquats coming in pretty good now. Another avocado right there. Another new little come crop. Going pretty good. All right, as you can see, these are all the tomatoes. As the season's coming to an end, they're still in the containers. Doing pretty good. Still plentiful. Still able to harvest a lot. See, it's still green. Some change colors. They all doing good. Look at them all. These things are about at least like nine feet tall almost. But everything's doing good. Can't complain. And then down here, starting to get plenty of peppers coming in. This thing's I want to say about four feet tall now, but you can see all the peppers. All them coming in. Still doing good. Some did pretty good, some didn't, but you see little banana peppers coming in. Still plenty more. A whole bunch of them down there, some big boys down there. And some more peppers. And you see the other one down here, pretty big. Peppers are doing really good here. Right here I got the butternut squash. Been harvest off this few times. Got some babies in there coming out. Doing pretty good. All in containers. Russell sprouts. Those are doing pretty good. Look at them. Each one of them doing good. Those are I, I planted in the spring. They're just now starting to do something. Here is the elderberry. I put it on this side. Looking pretty good. See how much bigger they got since spring, summer. Now fall's coming. Still the containers. Right here is the raspberries. Let me get a little closer so I can give you a little show of how this is working here. I, I plan on putting a little trellis here and have this up going up about six feet, but let me show you what I got going on here. Look at them raspberries. Not bad for a first time gardener. Not bad at all. And they're still in pots. So I plan on putting them in the ground here. Probably trellising them up over this fence here. 
about six feet tall, trim them up and just let them grow outward. All right, you guys, this is where I got the blueberries, strawberries, and the watermelon. Let you guys take a good look here. Blueberries are definitely coming in, as you can see. Very plentiful. Still in the pot. Then I got all the strawberries with the watermelon vines coming through. You see the watermelon right there. That's the sugar baby right there. That's one of them. And then another watermelon right there. There's one in the far back behind there. Kind of see it, but it's sitting right there in a little stocking, and there's some more coming in. Yeah, I mean, I planned them kind of late, but yeah, learning, having fun with it. And then you can see the strawberries coming in still, plenty of strawberries. And you can see the watermelon over there in the far back. Let's see, like the camera over there, there it is. And then more blueberries coming in. And then I got one pink lemonade berry so far this year. But hey, it's still a young little tree or bush. So I expect more next year. Here is sweet potatoes, both of them in pots. I did that like mid-summer, I want to say. Doing pretty good. Some more strawberries. See them all flowering up. Some strawberries coming in. I had to put them in these because the birds are getting to them. Alright, you guys. So now, here, I put in the trees in the ground. My kids helped me out. Let's check this one out over here, and I'll put some over here as well. Uh, let's go over here and take a look at this. So I hope you guys can see my vision, how I want these. So I don't want them to get no taller than six feet, but I want these trees to branch out like bushes. So I've been trimming them back a little bit. But this here is, let's see, Arctic Glow. Arctic glow. So this here is a nectarine tree. This one here is a peach tree. And this is the red haven. I had to hit it up a little bit of oil because the white uh, flies, butterflies are flying around chewing it up. So but same with this one here. White butterflies are getting to them. But See, I don't want them getting real tall than six feet. It's about as high as the fence. And then I want them to bush out. So I give them plenty of room in between to bush out. This one here is a... Let me see if I can get to it here. And another peach. That here is a plum tree. Which I plan on having plenty of. And this is your Stanley plum. This one here, I think I might put it in the ground a little bit too early. But let's see what happens. This, this is the Cortland. About seven, eight feet tall. Pretty nice honey crisp apple tree. It's getting there. It's about like five feet. Then this is my other apple tree. This is, I believe, the red delicious. Let me just check and make sure here. Yep. Red delicious. Almost pretty tall. Definitely got to trim that down a little bit. 
So I wanted to have these all bush out. I don't want them to be big and tall. So let's... All right, you guys, learning to grow my own. I'm doing my thing for a healthier lifestyle. So I'll let you guys take a little look. Not bad, huh? Not bad for my first year. All right, you guys, I'm out. Stay blessed.